Hey everybody, uh, welcome back to Soma. So unfortunately, my fucking, I thought Dead Gear would work, but Dead Gear is an absolute piece of fucking shit. I hate Chai for giving me that, that garbage ass tool, but I lost about fucking half an hour or something of footage. I have to go back and re-record the whole route over here, but unfortunately it won't be as spontaneous, of course, because I know all the scares and shit, and I actually got really freaked out by the fish and stuff, so I have to do that again, but also because of that, I'm not gonna do face cam, uh, because that's just too much of a hassle now, uh, because I have, I, I don't have face cam to go with that footage, uh, and I saw that the game is only about, like, 40 more minutes or something. I didn't spoil it by watching an LP, but... I watched the, or I checked the full LP and saw that it was about like 40 minutes or something from the ending where we are now, so... I figure we just do that. Like this. I should have enough room on my disc in order to complete it. Uh. Ah, there we go. Took a while. Story circulating at Omicron. Oh, God. Listen, son. We're on an important mission, and we need your help to operate the Omega space gun. When it's done, we can all head back up the plateau. But now we need to get moving. Of course. Head on through to the habitat. We shut off the front section of reserve power. All right. See you soon. Okay. Excuse me? Let's see, I'm now here. I wonder if I need to make a run for it. Oh, great. If I do run first, no, second right, first left, left. There's something here though. Well, we'll see. We're probably gonna get one more nasty surprise. One more enemy we need to face. Oh, Jesus. 
Close. Close. Close! Oh shit, it's over here. Move on. Outside. You can come in if you want. One way to do that. All right, what do we have here? Ooh, lots of rooms. Not very. Excuse me? photo we did not get the whole picture there can't we do anything for him no we're out of sedatives if we had a gun this would be the time to pull it out <sighs> did not expect it to end like this should have jumped the climber back to Omicron without the Ark Forget about the Ark. No, you don't get to say that. It's the only thing left of value. You know that. <sighs> yeah, yeah. Promise you won't leave it behind. We'll all be dead one day. Then what? We'll better keep it safe until then. Don't want the wild to take it, swallow it whole. <sighs> I'm sorry, Catherine. 
It's okay, Ian. Just let it out. Let it all out. Oh my god. Alright, let's go take a look at, uh, we have two places. Here we go. It's the other way. Huh. Never mind then. Wait, what? That's Ross. Yeah. Okay. Maybe the WoW wants to destroy itself. Maybe because it has a conscience. Makes you wonder what's down here. Oops. bad. I'm sorry. Guess this was optional. I was hoping to see Omicron today. The evacuation ordered by people at Theta was a gift, an excuse to leave Alpha and abandon the WoW. As the storm cleared, we were swarmed by monsters that the WoW had facilitated. We were ambushed and forced back towards Tau. Glasser, Kofsky, Goatsy, and I survived. Claire's in the infirmary, but it doesn't look good. Kofsky made a run for it. To check observatory... Hmm? Observator observation for anything resembling food. Going outside is beyond dangerous. It's like going to buy cigarettes in a hurricane. She came back and she had some crumbs with her. We all knew it was empty. I think she just wanted a chance to die without carrying the responsibility of taking it herself. People from the plateau showed up. It was a group of engineers from Theta telling us that they wanted to use the Omega Space Gun to launch something called the Ark. It's an artificial world that carries brain scans made from people working at Pathos 2. The idea is silly but endearing. We all agreed to do a scan so we could take part in this afterlife. Some of the engineers returned from Pi. Apparently, they postponed the Ark launch. They were all in a very foul mood and difficult to get straight answers from. Except for one very important thing. They all wished to remain at Tau to figure this Ark business out, but they had scheduled for the Climber to pick them up tomorrow. Someone would need to catch the Climber to alert Omicron to what was happening. Luckily, Glasser and I were able to take on this mission. I'll finally be able to warn Dahl. Sarang. The pattern has stopped evolving. The WoW has managed to find balance. I convinced SSE Volchek to turn off all external control systems, making the WoW our de facto caretaker. 
So far, it's exceeding expectations. Since the comet crashed a few days ago, January 12th, the WOW has dropped to a low energy state. It hasn't abandoned its duties. It's keeping climate and life support going. But it's been simplifying the pattern, redefining its protocol. The WOW has started to grow physically. It's not just the core chamber. All around Pathos 2, structure gel is bursting through the pipes and bleeding through walls. I don't know what WoW could possibly stand to gain from this, but I assume it is intentional. The heart of WoW has claimed such a large part of the core chamber that there can no longer be any question to its heightened awareness. Not only does its expansion suggest an unexpected understanding of space, but also its own physical manifestation within the world. The WoW is reaching out to every machine, every life form, to manipulate, to control. It's trying to help save its creators from all this, just like the protocol demands. But really, what is good enough? Where is the line drawn for what is human and what is not? Would walking corpses do? Would a group of machines thinking they're human be acceptable? We can't trust a machine to know, to understand what it means to be. We have to terminate the WoW project. It can be done. I just need to get some help from Omicron. So it's the desire of WoW to be. It's not that the machine itself wants to be anything, but everything that it touches, it gives the desire to be. Whether it's fish, or humans, dead humans for all that matters. Cargo. What? Place cargo here. Waiting for cargo. What about me? Okay. <laughs> Doesn't work. Hold on. Uh what do we place there? Um. Well, nothing really here. Hold on. Check this. This might be where I came from, actually. I think so. Maybe not. Maybe not. Yes, sir! Hold on, I need some cargo. 